this is a topic that y'all know a little bit more about than I do. Downfall on the phone and they, they tryna harm me, nigga. I must have a shiny inside, all these bitches want trauma, nigga. I'm in the bulletproof whip with the arm, nigga. See how I slide, nigga. I slide. Let's get this shit started, my nigga. I got some motherfucking harm, my nigga. I'm going hard, my nigga. I'm going near, my nigga. Like, yeah, my nigga. Gabby Sidibe, aka. Most people know her as Precious. Mm -hmm. uh, has married a white man, it looks like. Or is she engaged? Get engaged. engaged. She's okay. getting married, yep. So, thoughts? Uh, I don't particularly... In terms of her her choice, that doesn't have anything to do with me. That, that, is, that is none of my business. The beef is the response. Let me just yeah. say, let's get to the yeah. nitty-gritty. Yeah, you yeah. have no problem with who you love, homegirl. I'm not knocking you at all. Congratulations, by the way. I first found somebody. Yeah. Rest of both of you on the union. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah. Hey, hit me up for DJ services, dog. Mm -hmm. I'll be there. <laughs> my beef is with our fellow people. Mm -hmm. You know, when a black man dates a white chick, and he gives the line that he doesn't want to deal with the black woman's attitude or their insubmissiveness or their blah, blah, blah. It's a problem. Yeah, we yeah. found out Michael B. Jordan just likes lighter skinned chicks and went in on him. Well, don't even don't even start there because that's starting from a place of us to fit yeah, ourselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's start from where it came from. Because apparently there were, you know, some some outrage. Got some backlash. Black fellows on the internet who didn't want to see that, and it was, oh, you know, why she with a white guy? And so the response that we heard from a lot of our sisters was, of her for you. oh yeah, you know, y'all dogged her, and black men didn't want her, and they didn't do what they were supposed to do, and all that. And so here we go, family spewing, right? And I just find it interesting that the, the points that are coming in defense of Gabby Sidibe aren't the same ones you would hear from us. Oh, well, you love who you love, mm -hmm. right? You, 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 it doesn't have anything to do with not wanting black, or at least it shouldn't, Yeah. right? It just, you love who you love. Mm -hmm. No, it's, no, y'all didn't do what y'all was supposed to. Y'all was talking about her, and y'all put her down, and y'all called her this and that, and y'all called her all these things, and it's like... Yo, hold on now. I thought we wasn't doing that. Pump your I, th I thought it wasn't. I thought it wasn't supposed to be a thing of don't use your disdain for people who look like you to justify you going out and being with someone else of another race. Yeah. Right. So what? What is? What is all of this? Where are we at with this? I don't know. A lot of uh, hypocrisy vibes on this one. Yeah, you feel me? Pot calling the kettle black, and if we can't go back to Michael B. Jordan, <laughs> he's on wax, nigga, saying he don't like black women. Yeah, but you know he bagged Lori Harvey, which is a light skin shorty. So <laughs> I guess that suffices or it meets him the quota. And and look, man, you we can we can sit up here and have conversations ad nauseum about you know what it means if you don't date a black woman or whether you feel a responsibility to do it personally. Colorism, like, deep rooted, this and blah blah blah. Yeah, it, it, it is what it I, is, like. Me personally, my choice, I was I'm always going to end up with a black woman. Facts. But that doesn't mean I have to force that personal choice on you. You know what I'm saying? Like it doesn't mean anything to me whether you, you date white, black, Asian, black Hispanic. Team, yeah. That's that's up to you. Mm -hmm. Whoever you can decide to be with and actually work through life with another person. Listen, this shit is, is hard enough. So, like, don't add, just don't you know, bring those your people down in the process. Yeah. Man. But just don't, do you don't have to say, oh, well, I can't be with black women because they, they, they too controlling or they, they too, they too attitude. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, man, that shit, shit is up. weak. But also, equally as weak is, it ain't no black men out here doing nothing. It ain't, they ain't taking care of their kids. They all in jail. This, that, and the third, yeah. blah, 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 blah. Like, that's equally trash. Yeah. It's equally yeah. trash. Love who you love, but love them because you love them, not because you hate us. Exactly. Yep. Thanks for watching another Back of the Bus Squad episode. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. If you want to check out another episode related to this, go ahead and click that video to the left. And if you want to catch up on some of our other episodes, make sure you click the playlist below.